and he won't have to wait for long. One combination coming down, Connor Swale just giving him some points, Daniel Coyle as well coming down behind him, so Team Ireland really sticking together as Bertram Allen goes last, G.K. Casper. Now, we saw this in the first round, wasn't the easiest, Bertram did such a good job, but this could surprise us, this could come in with more rideability in this round, there's more space now. And in the first round, Katie, he was trying to make this horse slow down and wait, so perhaps he's going to let the handbrake off and we might see a completely different round. Well, this horse certainly has the foot speed, it covers so much ground. He can be faster, it's going to come down to the right ability. How quick will he be able to turn? Maybe a touch slow there but certainly looks more manageable. This is completely different than we saw in the first round, but he's asking wow. the horse to go forward this time. They are literally neck and neck. There's one hundredth of a second between them. It's all going to be about this turn and then the final line. This is tight. Now go. The crowd right behind him here. He too. might have it. He does he have does. it. 34, 7 0. The arm goes up in the air. Bertram Allen takes the win. And the Longy FIA champion, Wild Cup Toronto. And again, a real testament to him as a rider, Katie, because so many challenges for him in the first round. He comes in in the jump off and says, Right, it's game on, let's go. He finally let his horse go, that's for sure. And it, what a ride. He earned every step of that. He came back with a totally different horse, trusted it. And it was just brilliant. That turn to that last line, that's what won it for him. They were neck and neck. What a, what a competition. Different horse in the jump off, but also a different test as well, because there's not so many related lines in there. He was allowing the horse just to move forward. He didn't keep having to say, come on, just wait, just wait. He could say, come on then, let's get our groove on. And it certainly got the job done today. Bertram Allen back there celebrating as he clinches the win here in the Longines FEI Jumping World Cup Toronto.